The People's Democratic Party, PDP, yesterday said the remarks reportedly made by the Minister of Transportation, Chibuike Amechi, about alleged silent looting in President Muhammad Buhari's administration is confirmation of the massive corruption in the government. The party claimed that the APC administration has been providing official cover for corrupt officials who have turned government agencies to cash cows and automated teller machines for themselves, their cronies, family members, and mistresses. The PDP in a statement by its national publicity secretary, Kola Ologbon Dinya, noted that the situation as presented by Amici shows that quite stealing is a policy of the APC administration. It continued, this explains why the administration is heavy on propaganda has failed to prosecute its officials and APC leaders openly indicted for corruption, but only resort to easing out such thieves with a pat on the wrist. The main opposition party said the comment by Amici exposed why the APC administration has failed to recover over 25 trillion reportedly stolen by APC leaders in various government agencies. It's added, Nigerians now have a clear picture on how the 9.3 trillion was detailed in the reported NNPC memo was stolen, how over 2 trillion was allegedly siphoned under fraudulent subsidy regime, as well as how the 1.1 watt of crude oil was reportedly stolen using 18 unregistered vessels. This is in addition to the revelation by the National Security Advisor General Babagana Mugono retired that billions of naira meant for security under the APC could not be traced. Nigerians now know how billions of naira reportedly stolen from various agencies, including the National Health Insurance Scheme and National Emergency Ma Management Agency, in which a very top APC government official was indicted, as well as the 500 billion social investment program fund, as reviewed by First Lady Aisha Buhari, was siphoned. The party further said, Amici's remarks had also explained the circumstance surrounding the alleged stealing of 165 billion naira in the Nigerian Port Authority under his ministerial purview, the 1.5 trillion and 9.5 million reportedly stolen from Nigerian Maritime Administration and Safety Agency, the 65 million dollars. $65 million fitted from the Federal Mortgage Bank of Nigeria as well as the $90 billion looted from the Federal Inland Revenue Services, among others. This is in addition to the alleged secret looting of huge parts of foreign loans and repatriated funds placed at the disposal of the APC and its administration.